Hi, this is uh, Josh from New York City, and uh, here's my uh, tutorial on the K Prophecy LED Programmable Clubs. Uh, I got these uh, recently from uh, the K Company uh, dealers here in New York, and uh, the lights are quite beautiful, uh, lovely, wonderful, and uh, they really speak for themselves. Um, here I am at the Cosmic Fit Club in Astoria, Queens. And uh, just as a technical note, it, it does work better in a dark or even like uh, black lighting. And they have some uh, a very good studio space here for um, acro folk. Uh, as uh, programming choices, um, you can program them in color sequence and then just aim them at the club and they'll be in unison here. Uh, just showing some basic uh, patterns with all the clubs the same color. Um, A little more visually complex is to uh, sequence the clubs in a ratio of two to one. So you can see that the third club uh, is actually following, it's lagging the color of the other two. But this is a little bit of a distraction uh, for most uh, lay people, but it is a nice uh, color display. Uh, but most folks uh, won't catch on with just three clubs. I found that with four or five clubs, Folks can see the set changing and then the extra club following the group. Uh, and it's a, a much better effect with uh, more clubs than with just a two to one ratio. Um, also note that, um, as you know, side swap patterns, uh, some of them had uniform subsequences. So for example, 441, which was a popular pattern years ago, um, as uh, folks are learning the basics, uh, notice that uh, each club does the same orbit, as opposed to, um, well, here, here it is again with the color change, and if you can time the, time the beats as you program it. So notice that it has a much different effect, um, which is actually quite pleasant when you go through the cycle um, with a color cycle as well, changing every six beats. Um, there, here, here is a, a four, two, three pattern Notice that I just have one club lagging. That lagging club is now following a different subsequence. And that idea is very effective um, for th this type of um, displays. Um, have another club that's following a different subsequence in another color. And that can that's tracked very well and ha has a very good effect. Uh, finally, um, transitions can be done with like strobe effects or any effect that you want. So notice that here I really coordinated uh, to measure time the start in red, the cascade, the transition in strobe, and then I, I probably should have used blue for the uh, shower pattern to show, but then a uh, strobe lets me know to exit the pattern, enter the uh, one up, two up sync pattern, and then return back to the cascade and done. So as you can do, very effective if you punctuate the light sequences to the music and to the transitions. It can be a really wonderful performance. Um, with four clubs, I guess the, the first idea, can, well, oh, sorry, hold on, this is my street routine. So um, here, I don't think the clubs are changing sequence. I just wanted to pause to uh, thank folks who supported me all these years uh, street performing, mostly in New York, um, in Central Park, at, at, uh, in Washington Square Park, mostly in Central Park. But I've also been to Europe, uh, to a few countries, just as a street performer, to uh, Scotland and Italy. And I just wanted to thank folks for uh, supporting me as an artist in my younger years. Um, notice this uh, sort of uh, after that multiplex flash, the, the paint effect, like the club group and the following club is being lit up by that color. It's being thrown on to the uh, last club, which is a very nice effect. I mean, here, here's a, uh, a club juggle and drop in and um, from the strobe. And what I did is I made the strobe sequence a little longer so I could have that transition part. And then it goes back and it'll always repeat the cycle. So it'll go from red to green and it'll continue the, the color loop. But again, see how much more effective it is with four clubs even than three, when the ratio is three to one with these uh, colors. The other thing to note again with subsequences is that um, in more complex patterns, even with just the basic five, three, four pattern, you can have some beautiful uh, displays here. 
Um, again, the ratio is three to one, but I have the lag club in fourth position, which has the same orbit as the first, the first, second, and fourth club. Uh, first, third, and fourth clubs have the same orbit. But if I move it to the second position of the four, then it's just down below uh, doing six three throws back and forth, which you can see in this video clip. So what I did was I, I said, well, why don't I just put those two ideas together? And um, here I'm holding the green clubs in my left hand, but um, I'll put the uh, red club, which I want to tour like uh, in five, four, five, four, like the clubs in my left hand. And then the club that'll stay down will be the blue club here in the sequence. So notice a much, a very, very nice uh, five, three, four pattern here with the four club touring above and the blue club doing the lower tour of threes. That was Joy Chen, owner of the uh, space. She and uh, Maxwell Klein are the owners of this uh, uh, Cosmic Fit Club. Uh, I think they were setting up for a, a wedding. Oh, and so again, just a display with five clubs. Here's just five colors, not changing color. Just a nice uh, display with uh, multiplex. Uh, now that I'm in my late 40s, um, note that uh, like single doubles, I learned this just a few years ago and it's really not that hard a pattern to learn. You, you can uh, continue to learn as you get older, you know. And uh, back to basics again, um, four clubs and a balance. So here's just, uh, there's the color change arcing overhead and with those half turns. But um, here I split the ratio four to one, but the color is being thrown onto the club. It's following the juggle below. And then I think I even did a mule kick, a heel kick, and then bam! And then, yes, this jackass can even dance a little. So I think I, uh, did I finish? This is like a performance thing. Oh, there I go, look. Hey, I'm on my way. I'm done. Isn't that, uh, hey, yay me. And also um, a cascade again, just with the four to one ratio is and again, very beautiful to see. And wait, oh, there's Joy again. Oh, I think they're getting ready for the wedding. Okay, so um, thanks to uh, again to uh, them for allowing me to uh, practice in this space um, on Memorial Day weekend, 2019. So uh, there are some uh, basic ideas with uh, LED programming. I really do enjoy these clubs. I got them recently. I have a lot of people to thank for making this possible. And uh, thanks for watching my video. Take care.